Hey guys, Paul Gold here, and I've just took five minutes out from working uh, with some juniors from Europe, actually, who I've just popped in to see. I worked with them uh, towards the end of last year, and I've just come to see how they're doing. They're over here um, with their main coach, just doing some stuff, and I just popped in to see how the footwork stuff that I was doing with them and the movement stuff was working out. Anyway, I just thought I'd take the time out to answer some questions that have come in about the tennis footwork formula and the top three questions in terms of people asking about whether it's relevant for them were this in no particular order now number one people were saying to me well you know is this just for like a you know a 20 something a 30 something year old fit tennis player because you know i'm a 50 or a 60 year old guy or um, I'm a mum of two in my mid 40s, etc., and just haven't got the time, and I never really exercise a lot anyway. And or I'm a or I'm a I'm a guy that's working most of the time, and so my fitness levels are not that high. At, can I really do all that stuff? Well, what I'd say to that is that most of the people that I used this stuff on initially were guys in their in their 50s and 60s who suddenly reported back to me that they they found a kind of spring in their step again that they hadn't had for ages there were also a lot of middle-aged mums who I worked with who reported back to me that they had found levels of athleticism that they never really thought they had in them or even had ever had before and there were also guys who were working 40 50 60 hours a week in very high pressure jobs who reported back to me that yeah they had time to fit it in because we were only doing 20 minutes of this stuff at a time so in terms of anyone being skeptical about whether it would work for them i can say categorically yes it can and will work for you